Today's featured video is uh, James Taylor Every Day. Yesterday was my 36th wedding anniversary. Now, for any marriage, it's, it's hard to get through. It really is. And then they say, well, if you make it past the first seven years, you're pretty much all set. But we've heard a lot about a lot of marriages that they broke up after that. When you add in PTSD, then you know it is extremely hard to get through it. But I want you to know you can get through it and you can survive and you can be happy that you did. I know a lot of couples who have been married even longer than we have. It's both our second marriages. And both those first marriages ended way before seven years. So know that, yeah, you can do this. And every day it can get a little stronger. It doesn't have to be a roller coaster all the time. You have to love each other, support each other, want what's best for each other. If you're living with someone with PTSD, learn how to fight for them. There's a link up on, on my site to the book that I wrote years ago. It's called For the Love of Jack, His War, My Battle. It was originally published in 2002. Because, while you may think that nobody was talking about PTSD before recently, I learned from the experts almost 40 years ago, what it was like. So take heart in that. Just because you didn't know something was happening, just because you didn't know something was real, doesn't mean it wasn't so. And just because you might have ended your marriage sooner than you could have, understand that you did the best that you could with what you knew at the time. But now it's time to learn that it's your life. It's time to get in and drive. And the better prepared you are for that destination, the easier ride you're going to have from this point on. So if your marriage hasn't lasted find some comfort in this because you probably didn't know what you needed to and if your marriage is being tested find out what you need to know to stay together because as long as you love each other there's a way to do it so it's your life get in and drive see you next time